boyfriend cheating? 20 plus scratches on back not from me? So, this is a doozy. A couple of weeks back, I posted a photo of my boyfriend and I on social media. He got upset and didn't want me to post it. I ended up posting it, but I asked him if he didn't want me to post it in case, someone else, saw the photo. He denied this. I asked a couple more times in a light-hearted manner, then dropped it. Fast forward to a week later, and he came over on a Friday night. We had sex, but I did not scratch his back. I never scratch his back during sex, and would know if I had done this. Fast forward to two nights later, Sunday. He has a shower, comes into the living room, and has 20 plus scratches on his back. I asked him where they came from, and he seemed clueless and said it must have been me, from Friday night when we had sex. I was like, no. I don't scratch your back during sex, and my fingernails aren't even long enough to make marks like that. He had absolutely no idea where they came from. We watched some TV, but I had a horrible feeling in my gut the whole time. Once the show we were watching was over, I had to ask. I said, did someone else make those scratches on your back? He got pretty upset, and said, no, we have already talked about this. There is no one else. I dropped it, and we had a pretty decent evening after that. He slept over, things seemed normal, then he left. Later that day he messaged me asking to call me. While on the phone, he made it clear that he was still upset that I asked about those scratches, and had been upset all day. He is very mad that I didn't trust him. We talked for about 20 minutes, about my previous relationship, where I trusted the guy completely, and he fucked me over by lying to me the whole time we dated. Anyway, we broke up over the phone. I am actively seeking help by going to a therapist, to try and understand why I have trust issues and how to move forward in a healthy way. However, I don't understand where those scratch marks came from, and I'm pretty sure that I caught him, and he broke up with me for this reason, and not for the reason that he was mad that I didn't trust him. When I asked him about the social media thing, and about the scratches, he got upset and defensive. I find that super strange as well. Anyways, I'm just looking to get some opinions on this. I feel okay about the breakup, and didn't even shed a tear, but am still significant other curious about those scratches and the way he reacted to everything. Help a sister out and share your opinions on this. Thanks. And hash x200b. xx. Unless he fought with a thousand of angry cats in a battle to save humanity from destruction with an armor that left his back unprotected, he cheated on you. Guess it depends really I always say go with your gut. Sometimes I leave marks on my own back by itching but it's not 20 plus as you describe. But a good decent spot on the shoulders or middle back. But if he is having sex with someone else he's being entirely selfish and honestly I wouldn't have sex with someone you're unsure about. STI, D. HIV, AIDS. HPV, cancer. Unwanted pregnancy. A pregnancy with an illness also means the child gets the STI, D. These things are not minor and a condom if you're using it is still not 100% effective against all of these things. While getting HIV with condom use is rare it's still a probability. Is it really worth the risk? Yes he is cheating with a girl that knows about you and wanted you to see the scratches. Definitely suspicious. He shouldn't have been mad about your lack of trust given the pattern of behavior, events that has taken place. Okay so let's examine the possibilities. A paranormal experience, such as a poltergeist or a female ghost he cheated on you with a woman with long fingernails he pissed off a Karen somewhere who was into witchcraft and she put a curse on him, i.e. the curse of 20 scratches. Him getting defensive when the topic of conversation makes me think most likely is the second option. You see, you can only get upset over something if you're sensitive about something, as he was about the scratches. You can only get upset and defensive about something someone is saying if what they're saying is true and you're either hiding something or lying. Me thinks you had trust issues because the scratches on your ex-boyfriend's back were real and didn't come from either a ghost or a poltergeist. The first thing he thought of when you asked him about the scratches was sex. Not oh I must have scratched, itched, rubbed against something. Like doing a word assication. He got them during sex and his brain gave him the answer and he fd up as it wasn't you. He backpedaled, got angry when he was confronted as he didn't have the wit to come up with another answer and got angry as a defense mechanism. Oh and the blame shifting. 
Yup try to put you on the defense instead of keep asking him questions he cannot answer. Yup cheater. Edit not as clever as he thinks. Well not being able to provide an explanation for the scratches and blaming up is totally disgusting. I am so glad that you did the right thing. Cheating. From a past cheater. He's cheating. Speaking head he's lying idc speaking head. But to be honest sounds like you dodged a bullet here, op. This guy sounds like a total narcissist. I'm not sure how big the scratches are. I used to bodybuild heavily, and doing squats at 225 plus lbs, or 100 plus kgs. The bar across my shoulders would make me look like I had scratch marks. But this is a very specific look. Opening square bracket dot. See how they are, across, the shoulders. If it's up and down his back, then yeah, it's another woman. I just wanted you to be aware that dudes that work out can get some sketchy marks on their shoulders that are actually from working out. He definitely broke up with you because you caught him cheating. No guy who loves you is going to break up with you simply for asking why he has scratches on his back. Unless they are guilty. This has nothing to do with trust issues because even someone with zero trust issues would ask why her boyfriend magically got 20 scratches on his back and ask if someone else did it. Of course someone else did it. He sounds like a complete and utter loser with no integrity. I'm really sorry this happened to you. You deserve a good guy who will treat you like a gem. Please keep your head up and don't let this get you down too much. There are some really good guys out there for you. I think you made the right move. Fun psych fact. Someone who is falsely accused reacts with shock and sadness. Someone who is caught in a lie reacts with anger. It definitely sounds like it was the latter. If they were good-sized scratches, which I am assuming they are, he knows where he got them from. If he didn't give you a reason for them, then he is obviously hiding something from you. And since the only logical thing to hide is cheating on you that would be my best guess. But yeah, I'm a guy and acting clueless is something we do when we lie and couldn't think of something on the spot. I can't speak on the social media aspect but as far as the scratches have had dry skin and scratched myself in my sleep. He wouldn't have been this defensive if there wasn't something to hide. My emotional abusive ex would get angry as fuck and break up when I caught him on website for sex meetings or when I caught him writing to other women and calling me his ex. If he had nothing to hide he would try to assure you and not break up. I am happy for you that he isn't part of your life anymore. Maybe I'm jaded, but I really think he cheated and let you see on purpose. He doesn't even have a story for the scratches? It just kinda sounds like he wanted to break up and didn't want to explain himself. Maybe he was trying to get you to break up with him, so it's not his fault. IDK I scratch my own back in shower. It doesn't have to be from another woman. Maybe he picked a fight with a rabid bobcat. Maybe he and his best friend decided to scratch each other's backs and his bro friend got carried away. Maybe he backed into barbed wire because he's a fast-talking city dude and he said he liked salsa made in. New York City. You and him both know where those scratches came from. Unless someone dropped an angry cat on his back, the answer is rough sex. He slept with someone else and lied to your face. Okay it's very likely a lie that he has no idea where they came from and his didn't you do that Friday gaslight as pathetic cover. That alone is highly sus. You don't have trust issues because the person you date has done something untrustworthy. In this case it's all him trying to make you doubt yourself. You pointed out something suspect and he reacted defensively probably confirming your opinion. Be confident you were probably right and comfortable you made the right call by breaking up. An innocent person doesn't get mad. They get surprised, and hopefully reassuring. One time I had a scratch in the shape of AJ on my back and my husband tried to swear someone did it to me. And no one did. I'm always itchy. I scratch myself in my sleep. My skin is super sensitive to detergents and perfumes even on other people's bodies. Just an idea. I'm glad you left. Yeah I scratch myself overnight all the time. It's annoying because I have scabs everywhere. Though him getting defensive is not a good sign. I understand being insecure about sleep scratching, but still. There's every valid reason to suspect cheating here. Definitely ask him about it though. I don't think you need a therapist to tell you that wouldn't guys cheat on you. It gives you trust issues. And I'll tell you where the scratch marks came from. They came from whoever he was fucking. Why are you still thinking about this?
He got all pissed off with you because you questioned him when he thought he got away with scot-free. Here's a tip to use going forward. When the story doesn't make sense, it's because you don't have the whole story. Go with your gut. Always. Girl, you know what's going on. You don't even need to be curious about those scratches. You know. This isn't your trust issue here trust yourself, if anything. He kept you a secret and freaked out when caught by obvious physical evidence. He was untrustworthy. Sometimes I wake up with some scratches on my back, arms and even my face sometimes. Not 20 though. Seems a bit odd. Op, this may sound weird. I occasionally wake up with scratches on the back of my shoulder. I live alone, so only I could have done it. I usually notice them coming out of the shower. Apparently I sleep in a really weird way or something. So not sure where these scratches are, but if he can reach them himself it might be a sleeping problem. If he cannot reach them himself, then this is probably not good news for you. He's either cheating on you, or cheating with you. Make sure you get tested. I would want to see the scratches before drawing conclusions. Like were they in parallels of two four-like nails? Did they run the way hands would across his back? I get all kinds of scratches from farm work and fire hoses and stuff, and don't notice until the wife points them out, so anything's possible. Except that he didn't have an explanation. I don't know how you get scratched 20x and not remember in the next few days. Either way, he's out now. Betting it's more than likely the guilt and not wanting to have to lie to you when you ask again. I wouldn't trust anyone with a load of scratches and no explanation either. Very suspicious. Trust your gut on this. I think you, have trust issues, because of all those scratches on his back that he somehow doesn't know where they came from. Honestly there is no way in the world, he doesn't know. You are being gaslit. This man got in your head and decided to make you think you were crazy. Would have to see them. Me personally, if I have a bad itch, I will find a door corner and run my back up against it t, even if have no shirt. Do the scratches look sharp, well-defined and fine like coming from a woman's hand? Nope nope nope. The shady behavior with posting couple pictures plus sex scratches equals this guy is fucking someone else. That's bad enough but he could be exposing you to STDs. Fuck that shit. If you want you can snoop for proof. But his behaviors would have destroyed a lot of trust and I wouldn't even want to waste my time. The only other explanation is that he did it himself when dealing with an outbreak of itching. Or possibly allowed a cat to climb all over him. And if that was the case, he would have just told you so. The only reason he has to lie about it is that he cheated. Don't feel sorry about any of this. He's no loss. Your gut is dialed in good luck and happy life. Trust your gut. I had an ex bring someone into our house for months and I let him explain his way out of every red flag, including finding underwear that I knew weren't mine behind our bed lol. I also think that him bringing up your last relationship as a comparison sounds very manipulative and was used as a tactic to make you not trust your judgment. So sorry. The trash took itself out though. My boyfriend gets some crazy looking scratch marks from Olympic lifting and sit-ups at the gym. He didn't know until I noticed and we traced it back to gym workouts. What does he do for work? For me scratches are common, crawling around in ceilings and machinery. But if he's an office worker yeah I'd say cheating. Up, I for one think that he cheated, and I am not usually the type of guy to immediately point to cheating. Secondly, I bet when this whole thing is over, it's not that you have trust issues, is that you have issues picking the wrong men, like your picker is broken. Third, this whole saga immediately made me think of Darvo. Google it. Go with your gut, but also the therapist. Reading this sub will drive you more insane. Question. Does he have really dry skin and refuse to use lotion? Because he could simply have a cheap metal back scratcher that is destroying his back. That happened to me once and I didn't realize it cuz I can't see my back. I understand why he would be mad. You're accusing him of cheating. I would get mad if someone accused me of something I didn't do. I wake up with bloody scratches all the time from scratching myself in my sleep. I also wake up with bruises or a sore nose or eye sockets from accidentally punching myself in my sleep trying to pull a blanket closer to me. Let me guess. The relationship lasted only for a few months? Even if he didn't cheat, even if there are logical explanations for what happened. It is a big red flag that he got defensive. But girl. 
He did not only get defensive. He also made it all about him. You. Your actions and the scratches make me feel insecure in our relationship. Him. Oh poor me. My girlfriend doesn't trust me completely for absolutely 100% understandable reasons and I can only think how much my ego is hurt and that she upset me. What he should have done is be there for you or give you reassurance. What he did is being full of himself. Being a massive piece of stinky garbage. Before jumping to conclusions, are you sure it is not a medical condition? Certain conditions like dermatographia can make it much easier to get scratch marks. One don't post pictures of someone on social media if they ask you not to. That's disrespectful. Two it could be that the scratches were from another woman. It's just as likely that he doesn't know how he got them. This is going to sound odd, but I often wake up with long scratches on my upper arms and chest with no idea how they got there. So it is possible. In any case, it's just as well that you two broke up. Enjoy being single and dating casually until you feel better about your trust issues. Always nice to ignore your so's boundaries when he says not to post the picture, regardless the reason, but you do it anyway. 